So this is the final GameCube Mini Classic, whatever we're going to call it. Um, so this is a 3D printed enclosure containing uh, an NUC style computer. Um, so it's an i3, uh, which is perfectly sufficient for running Dolphin uh, for GameCube emulation. So in terms of size, there's not a lot I could do really with the size after this because the motherboard's obviously basically the same size as this piece. Um, and I wanted to retain having four ports along the front, so kind of much smaller, you're going you're gonna to struggle to fit all of that in. So the top half contains the, uh, the controllers, uh, adapter board, and a little USB hub um, within that. And then the lower half obviously has the motherboard piece within it. There's a, a new power button that's been added in the top, some translucent 3D printed piece in here, so the LED sits under and lights up on the front. And the back of it then I see has all of our ports. Um, I had to settle for this solution in the end, which wasn't ideal. I didn't really want to solder onto one of the USB headers on the board because then the board would might have to remove that port actually to get that in. So uh, it's just a little loop back from one of the USB ports that goes underneath um, and then into the top half of the controllers. But I can I can live with that piece on the back. Um, so so yeah, so the original design was from Thingiverse, it was a Raspberry Pi uh, enclosure originally, and then it's been sort of resized, adapted, the internals changed around so that it would fit in um, all of these pieces. Printed all in PLA, the print time is only about four hours on this, so not too bad. Um, I've got the files that, that I did linked in the description below, um, so, so feel free to adapt them as you wish if you want to make something like this. But compared to the original, it's quite a size reduction. It's not anywhere near as small as the, uh, the, the SNES Mini is, but um, it's, uh, I'm, I'm kind of comfortable with the size. So it's in white because originally uh, this was just a test print, actually this was a neat test print that I was going to do, but I, I kind of liked it and got carried away, so I've kept it in white, which is cool because I've got four white controllers, so that actually kind of works with it. So I'll show you some games running on it uh, now and, and, and how it performs. So running Windows 10, let's uh, launch up Dolphin here and then just run through a few games, kind of show you how they're, they're running at the moment on it. So as the GPU is pretty poor on this, we've not bothered with um, many enhancements in terms of extra resolution, anything like that, but um, you see everything runs pretty good.